find the LCM and HCF of 20, 40 and 60. To find the HCF and LCM, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. That is C. 20, 40, 60. Okay, next. Now here we have 20. 20 is 5 fours 20. Now 4 is 2 twos 4. Now 2 is a prime number so we take 2 ones 2. Now here we have 40. 40 is 5 eights 40. Now 8 is 2 fours 8. Now 4 is 2 twos 4. Now 2 is a prime number so we take 2 ones 2. Now for this number last digit is 0 so we take 5 here. First number is 6. A number close to 6 in 5 table is 5 ones 5. 6 minus 5 is 1, 1 carried forward making it 10. When do we get 10 in 5 table? 5 2 is 10. Now here we have 12, 12 is 2 6 12. Now 6 is 2 3 6. Now 3 is a prime number so we take 3 ones 3. So now our HCF is HCF is the product of numbers that must be present here and here and also here. So now we should find the numbers that should be present here and here and also here. I repeat, we should find the numbers that should be present here and here and also here. So let us find, starting with the number 5. Do we have 5 here? Yes. So next place, do we have 5 here? Yes. So now you cut 5 right here. Now next number is 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So next place, do we have 2 here? Yes. So now you cut 2 right here. Next number is 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. In the next place, do we have 2 here? Yes. So you cut 2 right here. No more numbers are left. Therefore, now you multiply these numbers, whatever number you get, that is your HCF. That is 5 into 2, 10, 10 into 2, 20. So now to get LCM to the number whatever you got as HCF, to that we should multiply by certain numbers. How do we decide those numbers? See, here each number is cut, here 2 is not cut. Do we have 2 here? No. So you cut 2 right here. Now here 3 is not cut, so you cut 3 right here. Now you see each number has been cut. Therefore, you multiply these numbers, whatever number you get, that is your LCM. So let us multiply. That is 20 into 2, 40 into 3, 120. So this is our LCM and this is our HCF. Am I clear?